Hey guys, third video of the day. Um, I know I've done um, three videos today, and I'm not normally the type to do th at least a vi at least uh, one video each day. Um, but since I had quite an, a few ideas today that I really wanted to show you guys, um, basically what I'm trying to do with Ashley Lynn for it when zero right now before I move is to basically start my makeup and my reviews basically that's why i'm doing my reviews on all of the makeup that i own right now because um once i move i'll have to, um i won't be able to right away because i'll be having to settle in and stuff like that um i'm also starting as of probably i'm not sure when but as soon as i can i'm going to be starting a vlog and um Basically, it's going to be about all of my makeup. Um, I also am trying to find a uh, video camera. One, because um, right now, all my videos that you guys are getting from me is from my webcam, and I wouldn't you I would use my um, digital camera, but since my Canon is basically just for my um, my pictures, that's all I use it for. Um, so I'm trying to find a video camera. If you guys can give me any suggestions on um, where I should go, what kind of what kind of camera to use, and um, the basic blog sites. Um, I know Cora does one. I know um, X I know X Sparkage does one. And I apologize if I do uh, screw, up, screw up her name. Um, and I know a lot of um, the uh, makeup tutor makeup people out there do have a blog and have uh, a digital uh, movie camera that they use, a personal movie camera that they use um, to make their videos. <laughs> They're not low class like I am right now, and I don't ha and not use their webcam. They use an actual video camera. Um, but right now all I really have is my webcam that's really, um, the best thing I can do. Um, but <clears throat> my last video for today, um, is a video on all of my, <coughs> excuse me, on all of my palettes. I have one lower class type one and two basically better ones. Um, this, um, I have VH Cosmetics one and I have an Ulta Beauty um, one that I, I purchased about a couple of weeks, uh, I think a month back. Either last month in, or October, I don't if it was this month or last month, no it wasn't this month, excuse me, it was the beginning of October. <laughs> it was in their, in their catalog and stuff like that. Um, so let's get started. The first one I've actually got is from, one second before I start making rid of these brushes. These brushes suck, so I think I'm going to end up throwing them out I go with this thing because they're very shitty. Excuse my language. Um, so here, I'll look and you can start again. Um, the first palette I have is from Color Workshop. I got this for Christmas a couple years ago. <laughs> I haven't used it as much as I I was planning on when I first when I first opened it on Christmas morning. <sighs> but uh, I think I'm gonna get a lot more use out of it now. <sighs> I've used it a couple times actually. I've used the blush. I've used a couple of the eyeshadows, but not that much. This is what it looks like when it's fully opened. All the eyeshadows are up here. These are the lip glosses, these two right here, this one right here, and this one right here. Oh, this comes out too. Huh. And this <laughs> in the middle right here is the blushes. And nice thing about this is you get a mirror on top. <clears throat> but this is really nice. If you're just starting out and you need makeup, I would either recommend something like this, or um, either go to, um, if you really want some good makeup, but don't want to spend a lot of money, and you're just starting out, I recommend you go to, um, e.l.f. Uh, Cosmetics, 
and you purchase their their makeup because their makeup goes from one dollar to three dollars for basically anything and I purchased quite a bit of their stuff um, I've got their um, concealer I just put my finger in my lip gloss <laughs> um, and I also got three of their brushes um, I think I got more than that but I'm not sure um, I have to look through my makeup collection again and let you guys know but yeah like I said if you guys are just starting out and you want makeup go I, I would suggest I would recommend elf um, to get you guys started and then work your way up from there um, but that's but that's like I said it's this one this is palette got it again I don't have the name of the colors for you the eyeshadows Well, that's that one. That was the color workshop. Okay, my next palette is one of my favorites. It's the 88 color, 88 color palette from uh, Matte Palette from B and H Cosmetics. This was one of the cheapest palettes that I've ever purchased online. This was about twenty-one dollars for this. <clears throat> I was gonna spend more. I was gonna buy the 20, 180 palette, 120 palette, but it was more expensive. That one was probably close to more than thirty dollars when I uh, was after about when I was after one of these palettes. Um, this is what it looks like. I've used this one more than I have, I have with the um, Color Workshop palette. Um, which what nice is about this one is you get two. Um, mean eyeshadow applicators and a nice mirror. Um, I've used, I have, another nice thing about this palette is that it comes with a red eyeshadow. A lot of, pa a lot of these palettes, um, if you get an 188 palette or a 120 palette from either Coastal Scents or, um, b &H Cosmetics, or even if you get an 88 palette from, like, um, from uh, eBay, they're all basically the same. They all have the same colors in them, but that's basically what it looks like. The only difference is you're just paying for the name, in my opinion. So that's that. You get them from the highlighter colors, going from to uh, your greens. You get a yellow, your greens going from, still through your greens. You get to go your blue, more greens, more greens, the purple. Green, purple, 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 and you go to your pinks, more purple, brown, purple, red, lighter red, purple, red, oranges, then you go into your browns, oops, I'm not in the light here, let me get to my other hand, your browns, and then you go into your grays, and then more your brown, more your blue, and here's your black, a basic, really black net shadow um but this is a really nice palette if you really want to have if you really want to start out with a pit with a, a palette if you really want the eight, either it doesn't really matter the 88 palette or the 120 palette the only difference is the 120 palette just get more high shadows um well i better get you going on this this is uh i have to hit this up before 2013 and I have, I've made a dent in it, but I've not really made too much of an impact with it yet. I've used it, but not as bit, not as much. But that's what it looks like when you... And, uh, finally I have one more palette to show you. If I can get this in here. If I can get my 88 palette back in here. And I have one more thing to show you. That one, this one's a little bit more tough to, um explain because it's a lot bigger this is, that. <laughs> this is the um 74 or 84 piece i don't remember how many pieces are actually in here but this is from alta beauty and i will open it up for you which is the only really nice thing about this is, is that it's alligator print it's really nice feels really nice and it comes with a handle 
You can keep it like this so you can open it up to really put it on your shoulder, but I like to hold, I like to keep it on so I can hold it. I'm going to open it up for you guys, and I'm going to pull it out piece by piece so I don't have to really bring my rug can down and make a big mess out of it, make a big mess of it. Um, but I will show you this. When you open it up, it looks like this. I have mine closed, but it's open when you first purchase it. It's a binder by it's a binder base one because you can move it from one side to the other. I shouldn't have done. There we go. It has a mirror with a mirror on this side with a little cubby on the bottom here. Ow, my hand, excuse me. I told you I'm not really good at doing this. A little cubby up down here. And this is where all the products are, right in here. Well, let's get started with this one. I'm going to open it up. And then you already know it's going to be pouring out on me. Um, first thing you do, first thing you get when you open it up is this. Um, basically, what you get in here are your basic blacks and your whites. Going coming down here is your blues. Coming down here is uh, more of your tans and your light colors. Coming over here is your browns and more of your whites. Over here is um, your greens, like, like a darker green, like dark. I can't really tell what that color is. I think it's like a dark green. Up here is your purple. And then up here is more of your loose and I will explain I will let you know what color these all are coming from going from one side to the other and I just screwed those up in there. Did I? Yes I did. Um but I don't worry I can actually aha uh -huh. okay um the first set of colors if I can hold this with one hand and talk at the same other time. This coming up here is Galaxy. Next to it is Gunmetal. Coming down here is called UFO. Next one is called Platinum. Next one down is called Sterling. The next one over is called Ice Queen. Going down, this one's Turquoise. The next one over is called Widow. This one over here is called Key West. This one right here is called Dream Girl. This one down here is Deep Sea. And this one is over here is called Oasis. Coming down here is Stardust. Next one is called Seashell. Sort of a light. Next one down is called Knit. This one right here is called Cafe Latte. This one is Starburst. The next one over is called Bone. Why it's called Bone, I have no idea. This one right here is Molten. This one right here is called Lusture. I think that's how I pronounce okay, that right. This one right here is called Silk. This one down here is called Toast. Yes, that reminds me of that one thing. I'm not going to get into that. This one's called Naked. And this one's called Good Girl. Coming over to the right hand side, this one's called Stage. Right here. This one is called Unsurpassable. Wow, that's a name for an eyeshadow. Interesting. Um, next one up is called. I don't even know how to pronounce that word. Vertigris? This one's called Green Isle. Coming up here is called Black Emerald. 
and this one is mint. Perfect. Up here is called Plum Noir. This one is called Amethyst. I think I pronounced that right. This one is called Wisterna Lane, I think. I hope I'm pronouncing these right. This one is called Starish. Star Rich. This one's called Bloom. My favorite one up here is called Paparazzi. Um, coming up here is called Night Sky. This one's Bayou. This one's called Blue Waters. This one's Sapphire. This one's called Cinderella. And my other favorite color is called Moonstream. And finally, the, for the eyeshadows, up here is called Pink. This one's Impulse. This one's Flirty. This one's Sweet. This one's called Love. And the last one is called Pearl. Now, in the middle, you're getting lip glosses. These two right here. Coming up here, we got Snowflake Shimmer, Sheer Rose, Flirty Pink, Wineberry Shimmer, Mixed Berry Sheer, Shimmering Quartz, Quartz, Sheer Plum, and Raisin Shimmer. Down here is Sheer Nude, Glamorous Goddess, Apricot Shimmer, Sienna Shimmer, Spice Cider, Morticane Red, Vegas Baby, and Crystal Berries. Now, what's just cool about this, and my thing is coming out, and I don't know why, down here are the blushes. The first one is called Infatuation, and the other one's the door. And over here is Afterglow and Flush. And this right here is powder bronzer. This is taking me forever, but I'm here. And another one, and final thing, final one, is in the middle. I can get the out here. Aha. Uh -huh. Good. Get the rest over here. And I'll pull these all out for you to see. This is another bronzer right here, up right here. And the rest of these are all to pull out. I'm going to show you guys. I got a full set of the eyeliners that Ulta has. The first one is Plum. <coughs> Put that. It's a purple. I'm just going to make sure I put these in right. This one is indigo. And to let you guys know, I know a lot of makeup artists don't do this, but I use the makeup after it expires. It doesn't seem to it doesn't seem to hurt me, so I just use it. And if it gets too old, then I throw it out. Um, this one is. This one's deep brown. And finally, the last one is, of course, plain old black. Which I use a lot of black eyeliner, so that's good. Um, these eyeshadow duos up here. here. I do all four eyeshadows. Top one. Silk. Silk. Truffle. Cocoa bean. And toast. Silk. Um, truffle. Cocoa bean and toast. And the second um, four eyeshadows is based is um, 
um, Terra Organzana Sterling in Eggplant. Don't ask me which color is which, because I really have no idea. Actually, yes, I do. Um, Terra Organzana. This one's Eggplant. And this one is Sterling, right here. Sticks. It comes with lipsticks and lip gloss. Okay. First one I got for the lipsticks is called Precious Pink. This one is also called Toast. It's brown. And finally, we got our number one favorite, of course, for all girls that like it anyway. Red Fusset. I think I probably spelled that in English. Said that right? Lip glosses. All the applicators are the same, so the applicator looks like. Too bad they don't have their names on here. I really don't remember what all these are called. I think this one is, is um, Siren, I think, I don't remember. This one is Princess. This one is Mischief, if I'm right, if I hope I'm right making these, I hope these are right, I really do. I took them one I didn't realize which, one I was which ones I was taking out. This is my favorite. This one's called Love It. Lovely. And you also get applicators, blush brush which isn't really soft at all and it's shedding and it sheds. Um, these are the eyeshadow brushes. The brush. This will probably be for the blushes. Or the blush brush. So yeah guys, that's basically it. Basically all of my finally all of my makeup that I have to show you. Um if I do decide to make another video, probably won't be today. But I think I've done enough videos today. <laughs> um I hope I can get all these videos that I made today up on my YouTube because I've spent a lot of time um uploading my Eddie Guerrero tribute video that I made for him yesterday yesterday because it was his 6th year anniversary yesterday um but I'll see what I can do so if you guys um like I said before before the tutorial before I went out in my review um if you guys have any ideas on where I can get a good video camera and a good blog site please let me know down in the comments or in um a message you can message me so um blog blog 
add, rate, subscribe, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.